We back. What's up guys? Yes, we are back with another reaction video. Honestly, I wasn't planning on reacting to this video, but we were just watching YouTube and uh, the new Inside Out 2 trailer just came out. And I guess it's the final trailer. She's very happy, obviously. I'm excited too. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie though. The first Inside Out, great film. I loved it, but I'm gonna be honest with you guys and don't hate me. What's that guy's name? The imaginary friend or whoever that kind of, you know. Elephant? Yeah, yeah. What was his name? Bingo or Bongo or something? I don't know. Anyways, I did not cry and I didn't really feel that bad, okay? Maybe if I watched it again, I'd probably like cry and have tears. But when I first saw the Inside Out, the first Inside Out movie, when I first saw the Inside Out movie in theaters, I saw it with my friend. And honestly, it was the theater's mistake because the movie was great, like I said, but the experience was horrible. So short, long story short, the day before when they showed Inside Out, older people went to it. So they had to turn down the volume, turn up the lights and everything like that, which, okay, of course, you know, I get it. But the next day, I think the theater forgot to turn up the volume. So, and at that point, I know what you guys are thinking. Why didn't you go out there and tell them, you know, to just turn it up? But at that time, I didn't know that was a thing. I didn't know, you know, you could just turn up the volumes and loud. I thought it was just set to one volume and that was it. So the whole movie, I'm like trying to hear everything, you know, cause my friend for some reason picked the very back row, which I hate, but you know, it's whatever, sorry. But anyways, so I couldn't hear it. But anyways, that's my story of the first Inside Out. Did, you've seen the first Inside Out? Yeah, but I don't remember. Oh, yikes. Well, that's okay. It's a great film. I love all the emotions. Um, lately, Pixar's been all right, you know, with Luca. Didn't really see that, not gonna lie. Turning Red, we only saw the first 10 minutes, but loved it. <laughs> um, and then Soul was really good. Um, but yeah, I don't know. We'll see. I'm really excited. I hope it's not like an Incredibles 2 situation. Nothing wrong with that, but it just wasn't you know, up to my expectations. Like the style? Um, the animation was great. I just think the story wasn't as strong, you know, as the first one, which is hard to compete with. But in the second one, they, you know, separated the mom from the whole family, you know, which I guess was point of the story because the dad, you know, had to learn about all that and stuff. Had to be like a hero at home. If you hear scratching, that's our cat, Felipe. He wants to be in here. Anyways, but yeah, with this new Inside Out though, from what I've seen from commercials, it does look really great. Honestly, it could be better than the first one based on that Riley, I think is her name. I could be totally wrong, but if it's Riley, she's getting older. And believe me, look, look at me, I'm not a teenage girl, obviously, but you probably know what it was like to be a teenage girl. You know, it's probably one of the most hardest things of your life. No? Yeah. Maybe. The bullying. The bullying, probably, you know, just the... Uh, <gasps> you think they'll talk about bullying? They'll thing? probably talk about bullying. They'll probably talk about love. They'll probably talk about just... They need to talk, talk about everything as a teenager. You know, what people everything go through. Everything happens. Yes, exactly. Yeah. So, I'm expecting all of our emotions to just fucking go everywhere. I don't know. And we're seeing some new emotions, it looks like. Like anxiety. Um, Envy, I think, which is played by our girl from The Bear. I don't know how to pronounce her name. It's like A.O. or something, but she's amazing. Um, but yeah, anyways, all right. Uh, so Inside Out 2, let's watch the final trailer. Riley, how was camp? Oh, so Riley. Oh, God. That was good. She goes away for three days and all we get is good. So the mom and dad. She goes away for three days and all we get is good. <laughs> yeah, so it's Ask the man. Back to the game. Oh, oh God. <laughs> Riley is officially a teenager now. You aren't packed yet? I'm the worst. Uh, overreact much? I barely touched it. Let the professional handle this. I'm too gross to go anywhere ever again! Well, that's a preview of the next 10 years. <laughs> I'm anxiety. I am just such a huge fan anxiety. of Anxiety. Or Riley's new emotions. Wow! Remember when we all finally came up to headquarters? Who's nostalgia. That? What nostalgia? Like seconds ago, nostalgia. Yeah, those were the days. Feel everything. Feel all fine. Bring it on. No anger. Arrives in theaters. Yeah. Ooh, walkie talkies. Check, check, check. Can you hear me? I gotta press the button. Go for joy. Copy that. Over. Oh, I love them. Yeah. <laughs> Don't look down and keep moving. Oh, God. She'll be okay, right? She's uh, embarrassment, I think. No, I think it's Oh, too. There's a... Nice. What'd you think? Is I... 
I mean, I'm hoping, you know, they're saying there's going to be a lot of new characters. I'm yeah. hoping a lot is not too. Like, I don't want it to just be the cute little girl and the... The one that they're showing right anxiety, now. anxiety, yeah. Envy and anxiety. Like, and then, so we got nostalgia, we got anxiety. That's true, so they're adding up, they're adding up. But I want more than three. Yeah. You want I'm like eight? I'm only like seven or eight. Yeah, okay, all right. Yeah, honestly, that was a really short trailer, like a minute and a half. It didn't show too much of anxiety or envy, like the new ones, you know? Like you said, it showed, like, nostalgia, introduced that new character to us, so I'm sure that'll be a funny part, because I'm sure, you know, nostalgia's not in it for a lot of it. Um, but yeah, I don't know, it seems like we're looking more into the mom and dad's point of view, too, in this one, whereas in the first one, it was just strictly oh Riley God. until the end. Yeah. Um, which I think is good because that's going to bring in more audience, obviously, the fathers and the mothers, you know, yeah. maybe it'll bring the whole family bring rather the family than the mom together. and the daughter yeah. just going or the dad and the son or whatever it is, you know, so I appreciate that for Pixar. I also appreciate that this is going to be in theaters for a while. I heard it's going to have a theatrical run for a hundred days, whereas like recently movies have only been out for like two to three weeks and then they're available online. For instance, the Fall Guy and like um, I don't know, The Strangers Chapter First One, Omen. the First Omen that's just on Hulu. You know, all these movies literally just came out. All the ones that I listed came out within the last three four months. You know, and yeah, it's a different time now, but we still need to appreciate. You know, people aren't gonna go to movies the first weekend. You know, you can't just give up after the first weekend. It has to have legs. It has to have good word of mouth, and that's what Pixar and Disney usually know. Me working at a movie theater many years. Pixar and Disney movies are the longest type of movies to stay in theaters. If it's not those ones, it's Star Wars. Why? Because it's under Disney still. So, you know, they know what they're doing. And, you know, lately, like with Luca and uh, Turning Red and Soul, um, those eventually got theater releases like two months ago and it made horrible money. But that's because, you know, they went on Disney Plus first. So I'm really happy that Inside Out 2 isn't like a Disney Plus movie, you know? And that just shows I hope that they have like good, uh, what is it, good faith or good, um, I guess good faith that it's going to be really good, you know? So we'll see. It comes out in June, I said? June. Yeah. So in a couple weeks. So we'll see. But, yeah. Okay. Anything else you want to add? No? All right, guys. That's going to do it for today. Let us know what you thought about the new Inside Out 2 final trailer. Are you going to see the movie? Are you going to wait till it comes out on Disney Plus? Like three months later? Four months later, maybe? Who knows? Either way, let us know in the comments. Like, share, subscribe. Thank Karina for being here. Thank you, Mirita. And as always, later, nerds. Later. <laughs>